outsmarting traffic jams, a new way to take up to the minute traffic information on the road with you. Stay with us. Thank you, Danette. It may be the most frustrating thing about living in Southern California. Traffic gridlock day in and day out. Now there's a new way to get real-time traffic updates, even if you're already on your way to work. Plus, imagine trying to swim. As if you didn't know this already, yesterday we reported a study that shows L.A. has the worst traffic in the nation. And now with summer vacation over, it's only going to get worse. So how can you get around all the traffic nightmares? Consumer specialist Rick Romero says new technology might be the answer. Rick? Well, Ellen, just introduced today is this handheld device called the Traffic Gauge. Its screen map shows traffic on our freeways in real time. Because up till now, we had very few options until we got right in the middle of gridlock. They're getting busy out there now to add to it a problem on the Harbor Freeway. It's actually heading southbound, so really it gets most of the morning commute. But Before you ever head out for your morning commute, you can count on ABC7 and Jane Monreal to warn you about all the SIG alerts and traffic jams. Or you can log on to the ABC7 website and get the most up-to-date traffic information there. But once you're in the car, Crohn's disease. <laughs> the radio is about the only way to find the best route to work without slowing to a crawl. But those updates are at best every six minutes, and they don't tell you about every problem on the road. Now enter the world of traffic gauge. It's a wireless device. You hold it in the palm of your hand, and it gives you real-time traffic updated every four minutes. So now you can take your traffic report with you everywhere you go. Mounted on the dash or held in the hand, the traffic gauge shows current road conditions 24-7. A blinking line is for stop-and-go traffic, solid line for slow traffic, and clear for light traffic. Over 850 freeway miles north to Burbank, east to San Dimas, south to Irvine, and west to Santa Monica and LAX. So how does it know what's going on out on the freeways? We partner with DOT, so in this case we partner with Caltrans and Metro, and we actually get a direct data feed from them and then rebroadcast that information. So they have loop sensors in the roadways that are continuously collecting traffic information. So in real time we're able to take that information and update the device about every four minutes. Traffic gauge was tested in the Seattle area and drivers there saved at least five hours a month in driving time. And they say it was not a problem to use while driving. Traffic gauge is designed to be read at a glance in a, really a quarter of a second. You just take a quick look at it. It's always on, so it's very non-distracting. Now, one thing about the traffic gauge I don't like is it can be hard to read at times. And I think if it were in, in color, it would be easier to distinguish between all of our freeways. And now, two ways to buy the traffic gauge, which sells for $79 and $6.99 a month for the service. The Auto Club will soon have it in their stores, or you can log on to our website at abc7.com for a link to the Traffic Gauge website. David Ellen, back to you. All right, Rick, thank you. He swam all